Hello everybody. Welcome to the next informational vlog for Drama and Simplicity and Regrets of Tyler Park. Today I thought I'd do something a little different and do a cooking vlog. So today I will be making japchae, which is Dana's favorite dish. The first thing you need is a carrot chopped into matchsticks like this. You will need a small onion sliced up thinly. You need a half a pound of spinach. Um, these are, this is about five shiitake mushrooms cut into thin slices, like so. This is a sirloin steak, also cut into small pieces. This is about three quarters of a pound. This right here is glass noodles, also known as vermicelli. Um, if you can't find glass noodles, I know you can substitute um, cellophane noodles or rice noodles. Uh, just don't use wheat noodles. That would not work. You would need sesame oil. Um, this right here is a sweet soy sauce concoction that I whipped up this morning and I will put the recipe in the description below. And you also need some oil for the stir frying. The first thing you're going to do is marinate the beef. And the marinade ingredients for that will be about a tablespoon of the soy sauce concoction that I showed you earlier, and a teaspoon of the sesame oil. And then you're gonna mix that up. And then we're gonna let that marinade in the fridge and while we prepare the rest of the dish. Then put your glass noodles into a heat-proof bowl and pour boiling water over the noodles until they're about covered. Let soften for about eight minutes. Once your noodles are soft, strain them in a colander and set aside. Now add your canola oil or your neutral oil into a skillet over medium high heat. Add the spinach and stir fry until it's wilted. Season with salt. Remove the spinach from the pan into a serving bowl. And do the same for the carrots. The mushrooms. And the onions. Next, add the marinated beef into the skillet and cook until it cooked through. Now add one tablespoon of sesame oil to the skillet, plus five more tablespoons of the soy sauce concoction, and bring that to a boil. And once your liquids are boiling, add your softened glass noodles into the stir-fry pan <laughs> until the noodles are translucent. Turn off the heat and add your noodles to the bowl. Oh, that looks so good. I'm so hungry. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I'm going to consume this entire bowl right now. Don't forget to like and subscribe and leave me plus votes and give me comments. And I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.